Welcome to Carleton Dominion Chalmers Center. Carleton University's Arts, Performance, and Learning Center that is honored to open its doors to a diverse array of community and university user groups throughout the year. Built in 1912, this historic heritage building has a stunning main performance hall rooted in Romanesque Byzantine architecture. The hall seats 870 guests, has an extended performance stage, one of the largest pipe organs in Ottawa, fantastic Corinthian style columns, ornate lighting fixtures, stained glass windows, and a memorial corner dedicated to war veterans. The hall is revered for its acoustics. Next to the main hall is a charming former library now used as a small meeting room and artist dressing room on performance nights. Across from the library is a former chapel now used as a showcase or meeting space, artist dressing room, or recording production room. Historic memorial stained glass adorns the south wall. Woodside Hall is a most popular event space for receptions, lectures, small concerts, and beyond. It has great light, opening straight out to CDCC's own beautiful garden. The parlor was formerly dedicated to the United Church Women and is now used as a conference and meeting space, reception room, green room, and small event space. On the second floor, there are various classrooms used as multi-use spaces for music ensemble practice, performance arts and children's drama classes, lifelong learning program, and beyond. On the basement level, Fellowship Hall offers a great size space for drama, music, and dance rehearsals, research center programming, and small casual performances. The building is managed by Carleton's Faculty of Arts and Social Sciences and is proud to offer Carleton students an opportunity to take performance-based curricular programming in a historic building. CDCC is also thrilled to open its doors to host concerts and events and to actively foster meaningful collaborations between community and university user groups encouraging diverse, inclusive, and intergenerational programming.